Hello my pretties. Good afternoon. It is Monday. I just got home and I have a box. First, let's say uh, for anyone who's noticed, yes, you're, you're not going crazy. I did dye my hair purple. Uh, <laughs> I love it. I love it uh, but I got a box and it's now the start of my subscription so before I get into that let's get into the informational portion of this video hello my pretties for anyone who is new here hi I'm Gladys on this channel I mainly do unboxings like Ipsy and BoxyCharm on Tuesdays I do a get ready with me called a mime time where I get ready in silence Last thing I do on this channel, which I love most of all, are mystery boxes. I love them so much. I have created my own and do mystery box giveaways monthly on this channel. Now, if you like me and my content, do all those things YouTube would like you to do. Like and subscribe, hit that notification button. Yeah, and I would appreciate that immensely. Now, if you don't like me or my content, just move on to the next. Because, uh, really, life is short and no one's got time for that shit. This month's giveaway has started. And it goes on until the end of the month, February 28th. A winner is chosen March 1st. Now, let's get back to our video. All right. So what came today was the AIA uh, Beauty Bundle. This is the second month in my third, my second, third month trial. AIA Beauty is uh, $35 a month. You get a curated one brand box of stuff. Last month we had all skincare. This month we have makeup. Uh, another good thing about that I am loving besides the fast shipping super fast um, is that you get to see what products are gonna be in there a week before, you know, the upcoming month. So you have the option to skip. So that's kind of nice, you know, what if it's hair care and, and you don't want it, you could skip it. That, I find that really nice, really, really nice. None of the products are now a mystery, but it is what it is. So this month's brand is Jason Wu. Don't know anything about Jason Wu. Um, once I saw that it was this brand, I did, you know, peruse. I found that Jason Wu is uh, at its own site. But you can pick them up at Target, which means their price point is not up there, which is nice. So, oh, here are all the products. Let's see what we got. Uh, we have the the bush. I'm sorry, my brain just like went there. But this is the Brow Shaper Soap. This retails for $14. Here is the actual package mirror and there is the product. It doesn't have a soap. It kind of looks like wax to be honest. What's it say? It says the bush. 
is a vegan formula brow soap to tame unruly bushy brows. She's strong, she's mighty, she's your brow's best friend. She's uplifting and she'll be holding your brow hair till the wee hours. Okay. Um, I don't have much brow hair. Okay, the last time I got my brows waxed was September. Um, yeah, I just don't have a lot of hair there. So it's, it's, it, I don't really need it to like be tamed. Um, I do have one hair, one hair in my brow. Just this brow, it's curly. It just goes whoop. I don't know why. I just pluck it because it's just one hair. Um, I have seen people using this thing. Honestly, it just seems like too much work. Just too much work. I don't want to spend that much time on my brows. But then I'm curious. And I, like, realistic me is like, you don't really need this. But scientific me, curious me, is like, keep it, let's play with it, let's test it out. Let's see how high you can get your brows. And that seems fun, yes. So I think I'm gonna go with curious me. We're gonna test it, we're gonna see. Because, you know, why not? Next item is this Magic Matte Oil. Again, curious me. This retails for $16. Magic Matte Oil, oily to matte instantly. Like it's magic, yes, oil but matte which is breaks my brain. Vegan formula can be worn alone or as a makeup primer. And that's what I want to try it as. It is a face oil, but it makes, it turns to a matte. I, again, realistic me is like, hey, you don't need another primer. But curious me is like, Yes, I want to play. So we are going to play. Next item is the Flora 9 Matte Agave Palette. This retails for $15. This is boring as fuck. Um, they are all matte. They are all brown. Okay, just look at my eyes today. Does it, does it look like I'm a brown? person a person that just enjoys I have to say that seeing it in person is better than what I've seen online like it looked very 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 light it looked like there was two like matte or bone shades in here and it's not I've never tried this Jason Wu Here it is out of the package. We're gonna try her. We're gonna keep her. We're, we're gonna swat her. Here it is. The color story doesn't interest me whatsoever, but I wanna see how good it is. I wanna, I wanna see. They feel very soft though. Here we are. The Top brow. This is the lightest shade. You have one here and you have one here. <laughs> Can't 
can't even see it. I'm sorry. I think I'm like schoolhouse giddy. Maybe because I, I very like speak to text and Siri repeats it. And it's not that you you really wanted to say it. you just wanted to hear Siri say a bad word. Yeah. That's me today. Here is the second row. It's a little bit better. This is like so far the best one for my scene. And there is the last. Now this is supposed to be the darkest shade. <laughs> This one's a bit more orange, but these two look exactly the same. But yet, they are different in this pan. Alright, so we know I'm not going to fall in love with this color story. Okay, I know that. And based upon the swatches, I don't think I'm going to like it, but we never know. Open mind. All right. Next we have two lipsticks. I don't need two. They're both the Hot Fluff. Am I saying these right? Hot Flush Jelly Roll. These both retail for $12 each, so $24. All right, let's open her up. Ah, uh, we one is jelly roll. Oh, and it's multi-functional. You can use it for your eyes, your lips, and your cheeks. I like a multi-functional. product the packaging is kind of like that that rubber mat uh, got a color on here I don't know what color this is, but here is the lighter one. Like a peachy nude. Here is the other one. <laughs> I like the sound. I am leaning towards this one. This one is kind of that mauve color that looks good in everyone. So I'm going to hold on to this one, this peachy one will go in a future giveaway. The sharing is Karen. Stay in line lip liner. These are supposed to match these lipsticks, but who are you kidding? We have 06 and 07. All right, these both retail for $10 each, so $20. Here is number seven. She's the lighter one. Number seven does have a name. It's Parisian Chic. I think that's way too light for me, to be honest. And I don't know how that is supposed to work with that orange PG. Here is number six. Six is in royal. Now, I feel like this would go with this orange one better. Because in my mind, just looking at the colors, neither of them are deep enough 
is for the two lip colors that we were given, right? Neither of them match either of these. But I'm gonna hold on to the light one and I'm gonna put this one and this one in mystery, the, a future mystery giveaway. I just feel like that would be better for someone. And I can give a nude one a go. You know, what if I put the, oh, what if I did the lipstick on the outer edge and the pencil on the end? Gives me an ombre. Maybe. Maybe. We'll see. All right. Last item here is the Safe by the Patch Pimple Patches. These retail for $12. There's 36 patches in here. These do work. Like, if you have a white head, you just, and like, you just pull off and it just kind of, you know, takes all the grossness with it. Now, I haven't really needed these since starting the ordinary uh, skincare that it, it's starting to run low. Like it's February. I started back in like August. It's starting to run low. And my, I do get the occasional breakout, but it's not pimple patch. I feel like this box is way too big for these. But you get 12 in each thing. Um, since I don't use them all that much, I'm only going to keep one. I'm going to put the other two. Actually, no. I'm going to do one in the future. And one in this month. So we all can share. Who doesn't get the occasional breakout? All right. That is everything. What do you think? Um, I like all makeup, but I want it to be fun. Again, I want to test it. Um, and I have many things to test. Yeah. I'm going to say this is... There we go. Which is a plus. Um, got some things I would normally not try. Things that I'm curious about. And then you get things that aren't my cup of tea. We're going to give it the good college try. Uh, we'll see, huh? I'm going to, it's not very exciting. Not at all. It's like I started with fun and then it just went down from there. As soon as I saw the, and swatched the eyeshadow. But that's it for today. Have a good day. I will see you in my tryout.
do you think? I have done natural looks in the past. I think by far this is my most natural. Okay. It's boring. But it, it's not terrible to blend. I wish there was a bit more pigment in this. Just because, you know, this color story is not going to work for everyone. If you're darker than me. More than half of these shades won't even show up. But it's not terrible. I can work with this. I'm gonna have to work with it because this is what I got. This. Um, I'm gonna say it did make me matte. I feel like I feel like you're not seeing as many imperfections through my foundation and my thing as you normally would. But we will see, I will have to see how this works throughout the day. This, uh, incredibly, incredibly, uh, Sticky. Did it give me any lift? I don't think so. Um, but I can tell you that curly cue that I get right there, still there. This did not push it, like make it shellac to my skin. So it's not like this curly cues. Sticking out. No, it's still there. Had to use many different things to get it flat. But I feel like they are a bit darker. I only had to go in with the Kosas Airbrow. So while I took more time with this, it took less time to actually fill them in. Make sense? But it kind of equals out. This is beautiful. This is heaven. I love this color. I love that I used it as the liner and this as the inside gave me this beautiful ombre. My lips don't look dry. They don't feel dry. Yay. Um, but that is everything that. Have a good day and I will see you in the next one.